Okay, so this is future Kylie. I'm um, right after the fidget haul, actually. Um, during the fidget haul, the quality will be awesome. But the first clips suck. I don't know why. In the editing process and the trimming process, it just really got really glitchy. So I'm very sorry for the quality. I tried to do my best to fix it, but it just wasn't cooperating. So I'm very sorry about the quality. But enjoy the video. <laughs> doing a fidget haul. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to Learning Express. That's right, Learning Express. We're gonna see what they have there. Learning Express is one of my favorite stores. So we're gonna see what's there. And yeah, I'll see you when we're there. To see. <laughs> We're here. They have bracelets that are poppets. Oh, they have a triple symbol thing. Oh my god, can I get Do it? You want me to hold? Whatever. Yeah. Ah. They have a peanut pea I know, popper. That looks funny. But the pea one broke right away, but we could still get it. I think, thank you. They have marble meshes that I don't have, actually. Surprisingly, I don't have marble meshes. I'm gonna get, I think. This one, this one's like a gray, but like still blue. And yeah, <gasps> there's mini poppets. Oh god! What you got? A bunch of keychain. Why did you really need more of those? But they're mini. <laughs> I know, but okay, it's fine. There's a Somebody's poop. Like making... there's, so you know, honey. there's pizza. Oh, pizza. Yeah. So the lady just told me that if you get two or one, if you get yeah, if you get one. Um, mini poppet. Aww. If you get, yeah. If you get one, um, mini poppet. Aww. If you get one mini poppet, you get another. No good squishmallows. We just got so much stuff. And I'm excited to do the haul coming soon. But we're gonna go to the next store. Close shopping. Yeah, close shopping. I'm probably not gonna film this, but. I'll hey guys, well, or er, I'm now back. Oh. Okay, I'm back. Don't mind the wrinkly background. I'm getting a new backdrop soon, so. Anyway, I'm in the new hairstyle and no makeup, plus a new article of clothing. So we're good. Um. So, I'm going to be showing you a haul of what I got. So, yeah, let's get into it. Okay, so the first thing is, let's start off with the front row. So, first thing is these mini poppets, which I have seen around on TikTok and everything. Actually, go follow my uh, YouTube TikTok, um, Kylie, Vlog Kylie Vlogs YT, and go follow my main account, Kylie. 8206. Anyways, I've seen. Anyways, I've seen these mini poppets everywhere on TikTok. So I just had to pick them up. Um, and the next one, this donut one, it was actually if you get a donut, you can get one more for like, I don't know. But you could get one more. I forget the sale. Half price. Um. So, yeah, that was fun. So, we're going to unbox them, actually. <laughs> um. So, yeah. Oh. Okay. So, ooh. So, here's a look at it. Here's the full pizza. And we're gonna see the click. This is the quiet side, okay, pretty quiet. And then here's the loud side. Ooh. Okay, decent click. I would give this 9.5 out of 10. We're gonna put these down. Next thing I got was this donut that was if you get the 
if you get a poppet or a mini poppet, and if you get the donut poppet, it's half the price. So have a look, have a look. I like that it's missing like a pop thing. Um, pop. Yeah, pop thing in the middle, so it's like an actual, like an actual hole and an actual donut. Didn't rip the package this time. Go me. Ooh, okay. So I'm gonna guess you hold it like this, and this is the, like the actual bun part. You're like, the dough. And then this is the frosting. So this is the quiet side. Okay, it's pretty quiet, but also has like a nice click. Let's hear this one. Ooh. Ooh, that last three was really nice. I would probably give this one a 10 out of 10. I really like the shape of it and how they are creative. And you can kind of use it as like a spit. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> um, the next one is actually like simple dimples. A mega pop keychain. So it's actually like a simple dimple, but like in fun shapes. So we got this bear one. It's pink with light pink and light blue dimples. Oh! Um, let's see if I rip open the package. And I didn't. Come on, roll. Okay. So here's the bear. He's the look. Ooh. This is nice. It's easy to maneuver. It's kind of hard to hold it in your hand, though, because, like, you're holding a bear. And I, and both sides are kind of loud. So I would, but, like, I would like at the top it says top trends. Simple dimples are pretty popular. Anyways, this one's pretty nice, but I wouldn't suggest it for, like, school because both sides are pretty loud. Or like decently loud that people could hear you but um and it's also kind of hard to hold in hand but it is the dimples are easy to maneuver also i could butcher the name of these pop things um so if they're not called dimples don't call me out for it anyways so yeah here's the bear one i would rate it Probably an eight because I like the design and the idea of it. Oh, Stan, excuse you. Um, and the last one is this one super cute. It's one dimple. Cross my fingers. I'm saying this right, but it's an avocado. <gasps> it's an avocado. Thanks. I recreated that meme for my for Christmas, I think last year. Any no. Two years ago. Anyway. I full on got an avocado for Christmas. I begged everyone to get an avocado for Christmas. Anyway. I am uh I love avocados. So and I didn't rip the packaging. Okay. Ooh. So there is a quiet side, which I do appreciate, but there is a loud side, and I like the idea of a single dimple. I think that's kind of cool and a, like a different idea because. Some are three, some are two, some are like like a thousand on the dimple digits. Some are like five, but I've never seen like one dimple before. So I appreciate that. And I like that it has a quiet side and a loud side. So yeah, I'd rate this a 10 out of 10. Plus I like the design. So yeah, so that was the whole front row. Now let's move to kind of like this row, I guess. So first I got 
what I think could be knockoff globbles. Could be wrong. We'll see. They're called sticky squish orbs. They're stre They're stretchy. They're squeezy. You can squeeze them. And they're glittery. So we'll see. I feel I have an idea that they could be knockoff globbles. But on the back it says the amazing sticky squish orb. Squeeze them, stretch them, toss them, stick them. Super sticky but never messy. I feel like that's kind of like what globbles are. So we'll see. Let's open them. I'm scared to feel the consistency. Oh, okay. They're not really sticky. They're kind of just, they stick together in like this material, but that's it. So they're not like fully globbles that like stick to almost everything, but they are like, they smell disgusting, but I do like the like squish part. You can't really, well, I toss them, I expected to like bounce them, like, or throw, but like, I feel like you would, I don't know. I do like that, like the squish part, which I already mentioned. What else did it say? Squeeze them, stretch them. Ah, so they can be stretched. The yellow one, if you didn't see the pink one, and then the blue one. Um, toss them and stick them. Super sticky, not super sticky. Um, but never messy. I will agree on that. It's not messy. But the really good part it, that I found about these is they're not sticky on your hands. They don't leave residue. They leave nothing. Like, your hands are okay when you squeeze them. So, I would honestly give these a 9.5. I'm going to give these because it is satisfying to squish. So, oh, Globby fell down. Okay, next thing we have is... This fidget spinner, or on number one voted. Anyways, fidget spinner dimple. Let's open it up. Ugh, darn it. I was on such a roll. Okay, so it does spin. It does not spin on your head, which I don't really appreciate it. Or I don't really appreciate. Can balance on your thumb. Ooh, that's a nice loud side. One thing I wish about simple dimples or like any dimple is that I wish you could pop them on like a hard surface. Cause like you can't. It's too big of a dimple. Anyways, I really liked this one because it's butterflies on it. And it's kind of like aesthetic. Anyways, um, it does have a super nice click. One of the things I realized about this one was it's not a keychain. Most of it, pretty much all the dimples have keychains besides like the dimple digit and the dimple. But like all the simple dimples and the trim and the triple dimples all have keychains so but this one doesn't so kind of like that just saying on the big on the loud side you can pop them on the ground but you can't pop them on the quiet side anyway i'll give this a nine a solid nine so yeah Next is this, what you're probably wondering, huh? It's a, it's a peanut. Why are you getting a peanut? No, it's 
basically a pea popper, but like a peanut popper. There's the classic dog, and then this new face that's looking kind of... That's looking kind of silly. What? Okay, don't buy this. One of the peas just broke in half. How dare they? Anyways, I can kind of put it back together. Just not one side. But I wouldn't suggest... They keep breaking. Anyway, if you want a one peanut popper, you can get one. Learning Express. Anyways, also, these are all from Learning Express, as you saw in the earlier clips. Anyways, just because of that broken pea, I literally got it, like what two hours ago like anyway if you i just because of that broken pea i'm gonna rate it a five also i don't really like pea poppers they're kind of hard to like actually get out of the thing especially this one so five out of ten not the best anyways now the moment you've all been waiting for let me move this back. The Simple Dimples. The stack of Simple Dimples. So, like, we have... Let's start with the two Simple Dimples. So, we have a blue and pink one. Sorry. I'm going to put my hair up. So, we have this pink and blue one. Oh, we're going to test it out. Quiet side. Loud side. Quiet side. Loud side. So, I feel like they're kind of the same, which they're both kind of quiet. So, I feel like this would be kind of good for class, but like still loud so if like someone sat next to you i feel like they would be you could hear it but i feel like if you slowly popped the dimples up you could get away with it anyways i'm gonna rate this a 9 out of 10 like the colors like simple dimples but i don't really like that there's a both quiet sides so. This is a purple and green one, which is my favorite color combination of, like, the, or the green and orange, the purple and blue, or purple and green, blue and, I don't know what color combinations there are, but, anyway, there's blue and green. This is my favorite, quiet side, loud side. So, there is a slight difference, not a big difference, but you can definitely tell the difference. Quiet side, loud side, quiet side, loud side. Anyway, I like the color combo. I like simple dimples. I appreciate that there's different, the variance of sounds, 10 out of 10, I recommend. And then the finally, I got pretty, almost all the colors I didn't get besides the blue. Which, I think the exact same blue. This one's a bit darker, but it's fine. Anyway. One thing I was playing with this earlier, but one thing I know, it notices that if you pop it on this side, so a blank side instead of the brain side, isn't that satisfying? So you pop it, and then... Just push down in the middle. Isn't that satisfying? They all come out at the same time. Love it. Um, I love the color combination, not going to lie. Um, um, and yeah, I just really like this one. So 10 out of 10 would recommend a triple dimple. Triple simple dimple. I don't know what you want to call it. 
before we get to the big two, let's put, let's make sure everybody's back in. Um, there. <laughs> I feel like I need to scooch more over here because, like, I'm all the way over here, kind of behind the go pop. Anyway, I found this, which, oh. Which, it's basically like a pop-it bracelet. So, like, you put it on your wrist and you just... Oh, this is just my bracelet, teacher. What about it? And then in class, you could just, like... I feel like Troom Troom made this. Anyway. So, yeah, you would put it on your wrist. And... Ow. Just got a sudden pain in my... Thing, arm that's what it's called um a human body part that i don't remember having anyway but yeah it's like you just pop everything and it's like a bracelet so i thought that was pretty cool um it is kind of hard from the inside to pop them so i'll give this a solid eight Ten, but I thought it was cool that it's like a bracelet. Anyways, a marble mesh. Obviously, it's like a nine. Well, not maybe not obviously, but in my opinion, it's a nine because I really get the idea of it. But like, it's fun to play with. Like, it's definitely like fidget quality, if that makes sense. Anyways, I thought it was pretty cool, um, but I don't get what's the like i get that it's a fidget but like i don't get why it has so much hype no hate no shade if this is your favorite fidget great for you i'm not saying i don't like it i'm just saying it wouldn't be in my top 10 but i do find it satisfying to play with i would give it a solid nine it's pretty high on the list um we're gonna save the big pop it for last we're gonna open globby which i'm excited to see what this is. I don't know. Um, I don't see a lot of people having Globby, but we're gonna read what it says. So on the front it says, take your stress out on me. My pain, your gain. Oh my God. I've got your fidget toy. Can't put me down. I'm your personal grip trainer. Do you have hand crutches? Crunches? Get a grip. Anyway. Let's open Globby up. Ooh! Whoa, why is this such a cool consistency? So he is... Okay, he's very nice, like he's very satisfying. Anyway, he can do cartwheels too. Oh, wait, he can do an aerial. Good job. Globby is very nice feeling. 10 out of 10. Like, why is this actually satisfying? Um, but the the packaging seems kind of violent where it says, like, can't put me down. I've got your fidget toy. I'm a personal, your I'm your personal grip trainer. Do you have hand crutches crunches? Get a grip. Like, I feel like that's kind of like, okay. I'll take my anger out on you. Anyways, you can shrink him. There he is. Um, you can you can throw him. So yeah, ten out of ten. And the final final fidget from. From Learning Express, the moment you've all been waiting for. 
the Go Pop Color Color IO Color IO the Clever Popping Game. So this is basically a pop it, but with like hand grips. Um, so we're gonna open it. Very nice packaging, I will say. It feels very protective, like it feels high quality. Um, I've never owned these, but I really want to like them because I really like the design. How there's like hand grips and like it's comfortable to hold. Anyway. guys already know I love this and like this is very nice to hold like these little things the hand grips help lots also the quiet side is pretty loud which I kind of appreciate it like this is the quiet side this is the loud side like, they're both very loud, which I love. But for some fidgets, I feel like, like, you would want to take them to school. But, like, they're really loud. Or, like, loud on each side. But, like, I'm in love. Like, this might be my new favorite fidget toy. I don't know. Ten, oh, probably 12 out of 10. I love that. So, I'm going to do a quick... Like brief of all the fidgets I got. Um, this broken pea will not be included. So, comment down below if you want to see uh, me trying to put it back together. Probably will fail miserably, but that's okay. Anyway, so yeah. Oh,
thank you guys so much for watching please like share subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss a new one of my videos and i'll see y'all next time goodbye